Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. A new deadly opioid is showing up on the streets of San Francisco, and it's poised to push the drug overdose death toll even higher. It's a stronger analog of fentanyl, so it's, it's very scary. Jackie Berlin is talking about isotinidazine, also known as ISO, a synthetic opioid 20 times more potent than fentanyl, and she fears for her son, Corey. He's been battling drug addiction for more than a decade. He told me that ISO is on the streets right now, and he is he's staying away from it. But she says trying to stay away from it isn't enough. Corey's already come too close for comfort. Yeah, he said he accidentally got a little bit, which I'm really concerned. Drug dealers are slipping ISO into other illicit drugs. DEA labs showing it mixed with heroin and fentanyl, as well as being pressed into counterfeit prescription pills. I want to make sure that San Francisco is set up to know what we're dealing with. Supervisor Matt Dorsey responding to ISO on San Francisco streets. I have heard from people who are knowledgeable about it that ISO, the, the new more potent synthetic opioid, even, even more addictive, more potent and more deadly than fentanyl, um, is starting to arrive in San Francisco. The supervisor sending this letter to the medical examiner in support of bolstering its work. I just want to make sure that the Office of the Chief Medical Examiner has everything it needs to test for every potential drug that may be out there that is costing the lives of anybody in San Francisco. He says closely tracking the drugs causing accidental overdoses will be key in combating the crisis. And I also want to make sure that OCME has the ability to test retrospectively to see if there is anything um, that has already arrived that we weren't aware of. Tara Campbell, ABC7 News. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.